Yeah. What do you say to the people that uh, say we don't allow for others like a future to grow? I don't see um, like when Future releases albums. His last album, Wait for You, was featuring Drake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I also don't find it to be a coincidence that we haven't seen the two of them together since her loss. Talk was... about that. Wait. Uh, talk about that. I want to talk about talk it. Talk about that. Wait, what's going on I don't with that? Know, I'm going to be honest with you, Reggie. I don't know specifically what's going on, but just as okay. a fan from the outside looking in, I'm going to repeat this. I don't think it's a coincidence that we haven't seen Drake and Future together since Drake put out an album with another Atlanta artist and 21 Savage. You think they're not frenzies anymore? I don't know. I'm going to be honest with you. But let me tell you what made me smile. There's a song on this album called What Would Pluto Do? Mm -hmm. And those okay. of you who know, Pluto, Pluto is do? Pluto is future. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it did kind of sound like Save All. He was asking, yo, what would Pluto do? <laughs> yeah, like, what, yo, would he do? what would future do with my... You know I mean, saying? is there any reason to think that they're not cool anymore besides the fact that we haven't seen them together? Did anything happen? I just I just remember seeing Drake and Future together at a high clip. Yeah. I haven't seen them. And I, again, I'm not in their lives. I could be completely just wrong. speculation. Yeah, just as a fan. like, Because I like hearing... When I heard... I'm going to be honest with y'all real quick. Wait For You is one of the best songs I've heard. Oh, my God. In man. a long time. In a very long time. Really? Is it better than Snooze by SZA? It's up there. Oh, I put all of that me. shit in the same like because like I don't good have R&B. Yeah, I don't have yeah like I don't have specifically a rank for it. Okay, but I save on those two songs like they did a lot like it, like that timeless is, timeless. That is yeah, yeah like yeah. that is high quality music. Throw a little yeah. Thames on there. I will wait for I you. I will wait for so right. And I love when they got together and did that shit. That's your girl. It felt seamless, right? Yeah. yeah. When we heard their joint album together, however many years ago we heard it, that's definitely our era and shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So again, I don't find it to be a coincidence, right? But Future is somebody, I guess, in his age range and actually older than Drake. Older, yeah. That when he puts music out, it's Future. Okay. And I will say this, right? Because I'm kind of answering in a way too, because I kind of had to think about this as well. I guess what people are kind of confused about is, I guess with Future, he's always himself. Yeah. And I'm not going to say Drake is not always himself. Like I said earlier, I think he's always showing you where he's at now. Yeah. Future's 39, by the way. Future's 39. Yeah. Right, right. Damn. You see what I'm saying? He's older than Drake. Kevin, oh, but he be talking... Yeah, yo, relax. Relax to my dog. Yeah, yo. <laughs> but when Future come out talking about Addies, women, you know what I'm saying, having mm -hmm. sex, living fast, he doesn't receive the same backlash. I feel like he does, though. Does people it? are like, oh my God, this toxic shit again. Okay, like, okay. I feel like people have said too. that, but Got I get it. your okay. point. Okay. I feel like that, too. And I think yeah. it's, it's twofold, too, because mm -hmm. it goes back to like the push a T point. Everybody always say he only talks about the same type of content. But yeah. The reason that Drake doesn't get a pass is because the way that you entered our hearts... <laughs> Literally, you yes. motherfuckers oh, get sentimental. Oh, Savon is saying you introduce a vibe you can't maintain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of those, you get, like the way that Drake, <laughs> the vulnerability, introduced yeah. himself to us was through being relatable, was through his vulnerability, yeah. uh, was through transparency, was, was through drive. us being able to feel <laughs> mm -hmm. something that he was going through. Yeah. And on this album, I know what he. One going of his lyrics himself. is. Bust that pussy open for a real one. No. She called me her baby like I'm still one. They say love is like a BBL. You won't know if it's real until you feel one. <laughs> you might have to fill up. You might have to fill up. Like, not gonna lie. Like when you know I mean? heard that though, like I'm not the whole like, oh my god, I need mature Drake. Although I would love it, I agree with the critique. But like when I heard that opening, I was like, I was little, I was a little like, yeah. Yo, like it sounded Claudine, weird. Claudine, 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 it sounded Claudine, a little Catherine. weird, like coming from him at this age, a little bit. So I just, I agree with both sides. I don't know. Was that, was that Virginia Beach? No, that was on the song with J Cole, first oh, person shooter. First person, okay. Um, what I asked, I asked not. Remember when Nyla was here? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we were talking about Drake a little bit. Hey Nyla. Okay. What's up, Nyla? <laughs> and I was saying that to your point that you just said, Reggie, you were saying that you want mature Drake. I, think, I, I do. Yeah. I know. I see the appeal and I agree mm -hmm. with the critique, but I'm mm -hmm. also like, it's fine. Like Drake makes the hits. It's fine. Like I, I'm not begging for mature Drake and, and either. I, but my thing is already, I feel like we've received mature Drake on all other albums. Okay. You see what I'm saying? That is and, a and it's point. like that is That's what I'm point. saying. We've heard it already. Like we've heard him talk about his story, his, his grandmother, so his why aunt, are you going his backwards uncle. is the thing. Because, but, but back You're going to, backwards but back to <laughs> but back to where you at in life right now. Who's to say? Like I said, he just purchased. I heard it's a ranch, some fly in Houston. Mm -hmm. Who's to say he don't find him one Southern Belle? 
Oh, how would I love and, that? And, and because just, he's talking and, about Catherine and Claudine and Claudine, and I'm going to pack that bitch like a sardine. <laughs> he, 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 like, he, so he packs mean? them in his, in, their, in his phone. He packs all the names in, their, in his phone like some sardines. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All those sardines are really good for you. Yeah, they're awesome. Omega-3s. Omega-3s. Get them up. <laughs> Uh, but who's to say, Reggie, that we don't see that again? Because I've seen, I've heard maturity from him when he was younger. You know what I'm saying? That's why it's giving me like, mm. yo, hold on, like maybe this is just. Oh, I you see, what, you see what I'm backwards. saying? Now? It's that is different. a good point. That's a good point. It, it, right? Different if I never heard him speak about his qualms with his mother. Mm. Ne- different if I never hear him speak about his qualms with his father. If he never addressed fatherhood, and then we get this album, I understand. Okay. But I feel like we've gotten it already. Uh, you know what I'm saying? And let's so not forget that he has given it to us. He has given it to us already. You get what I'm saying? So it's just like, what else do we expect? Like, especially you guys, you guys, this is your favorite thing on the internet. Actions mean more than words. Y'all love, y'all run around with that shit like it's a, an undirty t shirt. Y'all wear it every day. <laughs> your actions mean more than your words. What part of this man's actions told y'all that this is where he's at right now?